and welcome back to press sex for chromosomes where i have to go over here over there it looked like jaw was gonna shoot you right before you moved honestly i would have welcomed it <laughs> me too <laughs> huh. locked sam any suggestions i detect electrical wiring underground <laughs> see if you can teleport through it with your Here's fucking blade oh yeah no nope, you're on the floor now <laughs> <laughs> i love that all right where's this bullshit fucking there we go <laughs> oh yeah you fall off Ooh. it's that little robot <laughs> yeah this this okay robot yeah it's the i'm very meh robot why aren't there any androids in mass effect Maybe they didn't want to fall into like the alien trope. There's a bridge to the ruins beyond the so fucking alien, you know, like alien isolation. So the androids fucking everywhere and some oh. space nonsense. So maybe they just didn't want to fucking step into that. Okay, that makes sense. What am I? Oh, now it's open. You gotta wait for Joel to stop talking. No, really. Whoa. That's fucking <laughs> so some like. Two frames per second it's bridge so falling. Bad. <laughs> That's like the little bit of like Andromeda should have been delayed for, you know, the that last couple months just to polish some things up. And that's one of them. They they did delay it already a few times. But fucking like Did I just jump down there? Yeah. Okay, making sure it was uh it looks like a Whee! slightly safer path over there. But fucking uh Did I just jump over there? Uh -huh. But, um, Up the hill. fucking, I mean, EA did still We've push it the fuck out. Right. Watch and people, as they always are, Andromeda. Nice. Ah, I missed him. Whatever. I missed him twice. You lucky boy. Oh, I thought I could have. I did eventually. I'm vaguely surprised how many people are talking about Anthem excitedly. Nobody that's actually in the fucking in uh, Bioware. Okay, just like, fucking die. Only fucking dudes that are fucking like, oh, yo, fucking, like a, 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 a fucking, you know, Destiny clone. Right. I'm so excited. Oh, come on, I shot you in, like, the fucking ankle. Uh, oh. the bio where Twitter was, like, celebrating, like, Knights of the Old Republic, like, anniversary. And I'm like, are you gonna remaster it and re-release it for a new gen? Yeah, are you ever gonna do anything That'd about it? so nice. Or are you not? Because you can't, like, re-up the licensing. Both, probably? Yeah. Because now EA has, like, the Disney fucking... There you are. Oh, shit. God, you got obliterated. You got owned. I'll look at this shit later. Whoop. There we go. It's beautiful. Hmm. Even Roka can't ruin this view. Oh. These Interesting. Amazing. <laughs> Fascinating. But yeah, I think, yeah, because EA is fucking own all that shit right now. That's yeah. probably why they can't do anything. Also... EA's fucking really <laughs> blowing it, so fucking who knows? Maybe someone will get it back eventually. Okay, every every time I see EA's name on something, I'm like, mm. technically, I think Bioware could make it now since fucking EA owns them too. Be cool if they were able to remaster it. Cool if they were able to remaster fucking Mass Effect. Yeah. It's Instead of just port, or it. even Joe. fucking Origins. Oh my god! Could you imagine Origins is not being completely brown? <laughs> yeah, I know. No, I can't. It's just—it's <laughs> just like the remaster is literally just a brown screen. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! And whenever I think of remasters, I think of fucking the Silent Hill Two one where you can see the edge of the oh, map because yeah. it fucking thinned up the fog. Yep. Like idiots. Apparently, you can find Thetis in one of the original Mass Effect games. 
You can literally find a planet called Thetis. No, I, I think I knew that. Did you? Okay. Yeah. I had no idea. I was like, I think what I the found fuck? it at one point, and I was like, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I think Dragon Age. With the like old games, I didn't like really go to every single fucking planet. I think I just It was easier than this game, so I think it that's is. why I did look at a lot. I think I remember that because I was like huh, intended <laughs> or and yeah, obviously. Intended. Yeah. <laughs> the citizens have a together against the cat. Curse called the blights. Further study is needed. <laughs> yeah. So it's like all the council species are just kind of like ah! avoid it. Yeah. <laughs> avoid. Avoid. <laughs> oh, so they're like super in the Stone Age. So yeah. And then like somebody like commented being like, Iron could Age. you imagine if like Sarah found out there was like a whole planet of blue women who preferred women? Was <laughs> collective mind, and then somehow managed to be racist against them too. Oh, because she always is. Bitch. Yeah. No, 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 no. The bombs in the forge. I think when I saw this, I'm like, are they actually gonna kill one of Joel's family? <laughs> I mean, he has like 20 families. He, he has so much family. You gonna make it? Not saying that like one death in a big family is easy, but you know, because it's from like many like moms right yeah which i'm not entirely you got it. it's like sure or it's like, how the or many dads or maybe it's like one mom yeah i don't know no it, it's the many mothers because it's like if you have a brother and she marries somebody then now she's also your mom and i'm like what the fuck way to pressure women into like always being a motherly figure uh, i guess i i'm just like uh, different culture I, uh, I, know. I mean yeah it's a different culture but like if I married into a family and was expected to suddenly take care of like my nephews and shit I wouldn't be happy you can seriously snipe them from up here yeah again bye I just rush in fucking cloak myself and shut off all the bombs what are you doing what are you doing being an idiot apparently being a dead idiot And now you're a dead idiot. Now you're dead too. I thought I saw someone There's rush somewhere. Across. Yeah. Oh, there. Uh, fi Whoa! Ha <laughs> ha! being fought. Enemy reinforcements. Bloop. Enemy reinforcements my fucking ass. You can go over there. You're right here. Think to beat warn them? <laughs> Maybe. Doesn't matter now. Is there someone? Even oh, no. They can sit me a little bit. It's hard because they're so tiny. I have to be precise. They really are. Get out of here. Get out of here. Yeah, fuck off. What None of your this? kind. That comment made so much more sense when I was just meleeing a bunch of people. I'm gonna do this. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna die. Yeah, he is. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, <laughs> indeed. Is that all of them? Uh, no. There's definitely some. Nice. There you go. There's like one guy over here though. Oh, he's he must dead. have come back over. That must have been that guy. Yeah. Oh, I got some bombs. <laughs> I was all about fucking fighting these dudes. But I guess they're dead. I guess it doesn't matter they're now. Super dead. Was that optional? Killing them all? Yeah. No, you have to kill them all at the end. Uh, but I think I ran and fucking like you said I didn't cloak but I think I just ran and did it because I was fucking like mm, I'm on like you have to casual. cloak a nightmare otherwise it would just straight up murder your face oh that's understandable yeah is it the same time yeah so I could just do what I did essentially and still have plenty of time left yeah um I think there's more of them though I believe it because it definitely seemed way more hectic so this is but I also wasn't as thick of them True. So this is a fun glitch. This sometimes just won't load. Really? Mm hmm Probably have never patched it out, too. Uh, considering I encountered it on my nightmare <laughs> run? No, they did not patch it out. Well, if it doesn't load, I blame you because fuck you being here. I it loaded for me last time. I already jinxed it by talking about oh. it earlier, too. Nah, I took my luck this time. Yeah. Well, thank I God. I think it's like if you're still in combat when you like 
kill less enemies. So I think like taking them out and then wiping, taking out of the bombs is easier on it. Because both times it crashed, I killed somebody at the very end. Mm. So I think that is half the issue. You know I'm the leader because I got glowy. My arm is more glowy than everybody else. Yeah. The hands of aliens. Call me weak. One fucking fire thing and then electric. They're all dead. Oh, a hundred percent. You don't scare me. A hundred percent. You recruit kids and make them fight their family. It's sick. And so are you. I speak for our people. This is like the and fucking hyena scene I in know. goddamn oh, Lion King. Except they're gonna he eat you, dude. Except he doesn't get eaten. They just like go like, eh, you're weak and pathetic. We're gonna leave. Martyr me. Please. I dare you. <laughs> I don't kill unarmed crazy people. I love picking that option because it's just like such a blow to his fucking ego. <laughs> so it's calling some, someone's transition le lenses a high schooler. <laughs> Someone is definitely like 26 or 27. I don't wear trans transition lenses because I don't want to look like I'm in high school. <laughs> I've never seen. Well, I, I shouldn't say I've never seen. I just recently have not seen someone take so long. So these have such a fucking. I don't know how to respond to that. That wasn't expected. I I haven't had a quip like that for a long time too to that particular person. So it was just satisfying. I actually got really pissed at my coworker not too long ago because. Uh, he was joking around with the, the HR guy, but like I was standing right there, but he was like joking around with the HR guy. And uh, Chris said something along the lines of like, you know, like a guy like you. And the HR guy was like, well, maybe I don't want to be a guy. And Chris like stumbled through so many like things where he's like, I just don't even know how to respond to that. <laughs> and they kept going, even though like I tried saying something like a couple times, they kept going on their thing. And I'm like, all right, well, apparently I'm just not welcome in this conversation, even though I'm right fucking here. Yeah. And then uh, Chris, a little bit later, was like, he was like, huh, huh, how do you even respond to that? And I was like, well, I had something, but you know, you guys wouldn't let me fucking talk like dudes do. Yeah. So I just God. exited this conversation. I love it. <laughs> yeah, he was just like, oh. <laughs> and like went back to his thing and i'm like no i'm tired of this fucking shit because whenever like the hr guy is there mm -hmm. or one other person's there it's like i don't even fucking exist mm -hmm. and it's fucking annoying i can be standing right there and just be like seriously yeah like no, that fucking happens in my workplace too the amount of times I had to struggle to get something out because, yeah. like, my boss kept talking over me and then, like, somebody else in the office would talk over me after my boss stopped talking over me mm. was fucking infuriating. And I just stopped talking because I'm like, well, obviously my input's not fucking valuable right. at this Even point. Even though I could very much solve your problem right here, right now. Oftentimes for, you know, I can, which is kind of infuriating. Yeah. Like, it's at the point where I'm like, if you would let me speak... I can tell you the answer right now. My parents were doing it to me earlier and I was like... <sighs> Can I say something? Can you let me talk? Yeah. And like, oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> and like when I had the meeting on Thursday and because the crew that I work in is mostly women. There's one dude. In our, no, sorry. There's two dudes in our crew, but we don't see the second dude because he's like third shift. Mm. So I literally have never seen him. I just know his name. And so he like, exists. He, yeah. He, stuff gets he done exists and as it a seems, person. Yeah. And stuff gets done yeah. meteorically. Like <laughs> eh, it gets done, but it's not, you know good quality but so like fucking that walk every single time I'm like what the fuck but so like because Bioware went I don't know how to animate this walk cycle well and like I'm assuming that's the one that got shot so he's injured so I well, get shot in like the spine yeah so that's the reason why for the stupid walk but other than that I'm like okay this is dumb but um it could have gone badly so we had a meeting and it was just us ladies and it was our male supervisor. And when I, when I would go to say something, they would stop mm -hmm. and let me say something. Because they and, understand as women. Yeah. And I'm just like, like, I would like look at them and like make eye contact and do the visual confirmation of like, yeah, no, go ahead. Don't yeah. worry. And I'm just like, 
oh my god i kind of feel like a dude right now because i can just talk i can I and can, my I'm, voice I'm is heard yeah. Yeah. <laughs> my voice is heard <laughs> like, that's that's the one thing i've gotten and like fights about with eric i'm like dude you just don't fucking listen to me i want to yeah. know that i'm heard and shit like that fucking because you do the same shit and it's literally just a stem of this you're not listening to me right. obviously and that's probably where i can come off as like overcompensating and that kind of stuff because it's like if you're frustrated like that like that one day where you're like oh i just really want sushi and i like immediately started trying to make plans because yeah. you were craving sushi and i yeah. immediately started trying to make plans yeah so you could have sushi and you're yeah. like well i don't need it right now and i'm like but you said you wanted it. Yeah, which you're is still it. appreciative. So. It's weird because it's like I want things, but then I downplay it. I'm like, oh, I'm getting the attention I need, deserve, and fucking. Right. And, and, yeah, this and this makes me I, nervous. Well, and, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but fucking, yeah. And, like, and then fucking, like, Eric, I'm like, why don't you ever listen to me? And then, like, sometimes he's like, what do you want for dinner? I'm like, oh. But, like, but, like, and so it's like, I kind of make my own bed, but fucking. So I'm like, uh. I, I told him, I was like, I'll try to be more vocal and shit than saying it like once right and like oh i want sushi like really under my breath and quiet and then be like why did you listen to me <laughs> so like because i was nervous about saying what i really wanted yeah or or that or like because i'm i'm a people pleaser i'm like huh mm, oh i don't want to fucking like you know if that's not what you want then whatever uh, right even no. though it's like what i ultimately want Meet my true mother oh, okay but fucking uh yeah whatever i don't care <laughs> thanks x fool for being i'll go there just so i can finish shit for my my friends because he's the last one right he should be yeah but fucking um yeah but then i i'm I'm recently been getting into this bad habit because my fucking work does do um the same fucking shit Mm -hmm. is that yes is that here yes oh I didn't realize it. You, you literally go back to the, the spot that you just came back from. Oh. It's annoying. I hate Joel's loyalty quest just for this reason. Oh. <laughs> yeah. But fucking, uh, because I work in an office full of dudes, I like to talk over me and I have to fight for my fucking position to yeah. say, get word in edgewise. I've been getting into this bad habit of like literally just talking over anybody else too, just because fucking it's becoming an unfortunate side effect like habit of that shit i'm like god right. i gotta let people talk i can't be this person but fucking at work i have to be that person no exactly and i've had to do that sometimes too with some of my male co-workers where i'm just like you're not listening to me and i have the solution i have the answer just fucking listen to me i've been with this company almost three fucking years now yeah i know, I know the, how it works i know what the fuck i'm doing and like or like for me it's like at a very logical like an easy like function and i'm like i'm not a fucking moron what do you, who do you think i am what the fuck and i've been also having this issue with fucking eric where he'll like i'll be trying to say something and sometimes i struggle right to say things like concisely and clear and he's like and he'll start kind of trying to fill in my sentence like guess the end of the sentence and fucking we'll start putting words in my mouth and i'm like hey stop doing that because fucking then you really fuck up my thought process and right. i don't know what the fuck i'm saying and b let me fucking finish my sentence because what you're saying generally isn't it right let me finish <laughs> like <laughs> i know there's sometimes where i do it too where you're like oh i don't know this word and i'm trying to think of this word and so and, and but see that helps when i'm like thank you <laughs> i'm for glad there's one trigger dude for you guys this reference i just pointed at the screen with yeah that and then i just like i didn't actually even look at the screen i saw it out of the corner of my eye and just pressed it nice <laughs> but fucking uh yeah no uh like and i appreciate when i'm like obviously like i don't know the word trying right. to figure it out because obviously now i'm looking for help but like when i'm just like but like i'm like just because my brain hasn't fucking caught up right like that's why i take like weird pauses and then like make sure i know what i'm saying essentially right. because fucking my brain's just like i fucking words what are those yeah and you've actually talked to me about that before yeah. too like it's been years since you've last told that to me yeah so like whenever you do have one of those pauses i do like stop and just like try not 
to just rush into stuff yeah because it like can detract from my yeah exactly thought process and like that has been an issue that like my i think my mom put on my therapy papers and i think you also put it on my therapy papers and sometimes i do kind of like push into the into the conversation <laughs> maybe i don't and fucking remember i was it was like bubble city so i was like <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. And it was like you really you get really fucking you're like a little fidgety and i'm like yeah, yeah. <laughs> i mean you guys can't see it but literally i'm and you're fidgeting with, with your hands yeah I'm constantly fidgeting ah! constantly i flexed my calf <laughs> charlie horse <laughs> eat more bananas uh, yeah I potassium fucking, no, that's actually a bad thing about me right now i'm like super unhealthy yeah and i'm like well this says it has two percent juice in it it's fine <laughs> so it's, hel- it's, it's i get the somewhat yeah. nutrients i need right <laughs> soda has water in it i get water yeah <laughs> it's like fuck it yeah when you get like there's like one dollar like drinks that like applebee's has like oh like one dollar long island iced teas i'm yeah. like wow this hydrated me more than it fucking made me drunk <laughs> like, just super watered down oh no and i'm like this is good for me god i haven't been to applebee's in it's unfortunately close to eric's place i say unfortunately because it's not a great restaurant no. and we went there the other day and i had uh fish and they did that all right it was breaded fish oh okay i've never ever once in my life been impressed with any of their burgers or anything like that so i actively don't do this also i actively don't get steak from a place that fucking sucks already with just cooking basic hamburgers right so fucking um no <laughs> so i got fish and i was like all right they did that okay i don't i legitimately do not remember the last time i've been to applebee's because my parents used to like applebee's a lot but then it started getting to the point where like every time i went i just didn't like whatever i ordered so then i would have a very hard time figuring out what i want to eat from the menu mm-hmm. and i've realized that when i go to a place and i don't want anything on the menu is because i don't want to be at that restaurant i want to be somewhere else oh yeah no no i completely in the same way because fucking guess what i don't ever want anything on the menu at Alpabee's, and i actively know i don't want to be there right but sometimes it's convenient <laughs> unfortunately and there was like there was sometimes there was like eric was like i sorry I pissed you off but fucking and he was like and i was like oh i don't want fast food because it, it's in summer right now right i'm not hungry right. a lot of the time like i just think the heat is making me not hungry which i can understand because whoa sorry yeah, that's that zoomed, zoomed in and out but fucking yeah so i'm just like mm, i'm just not hungry feeling right. i don't crave anything i know i need to eat because my brain hurts but right. fucking i'm not hungry so i've been almost eating a sushi like exclusively because it's like light it's refreshing it's refreshing yeah um <laughs> is the bridge broken again okay it came back oh was it broken <laughs> yeah it was literally w- what it used to be i was too busy looking at you the dude the, the dude popped back so, <laughs> that's what I was like, uh suddenly but fucking yeah like so and he was like and i was like well i don't want fast food i don't want you know i was just being like these stipulations he was like well do okay. you want well, how about apple piece? i was like all right like red robins is like a block <laughs> down the road no, not for Is there him. another Applebee's closer to him? Way closer. Than the one that I'm thinking on? On the on Everett Mall Way? Yeah, uh, that that's way further away than the Applebee's. The Applebee's is literally like a block up the street. I had towards no idea the that way. there was another Applebee's in that area. Yeah, if you go, like, if you continue towards 9 on Cathcart. Okay. There. Literally a block from his place. Oh, shit. Where there's a Safeway. Which is, like, the last, like, shopping plaza. Before it's just road. Yeah, before it's, like, residential. Oh shit! Yep, right I, there. There's a subway too in a teriyaki place you know, that apparently are mediocre. Buff I'm looking. pretty sure I shopped at that Safeway once, like going to like when I when, when my you were aunt like house used to sitting live. or something. Yeah, yeah, when my aunt used to live around yeah. that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I stopped at that Safeway. I do not remember there being an Applebee's whatsoever. Now that you're saying it, I can kind of you're picture like, it. Like, like it's starting like to come that, fall into place. That, that's just been like a black hole in my memory. <laughs> Honestly, I wish it was for mine too because I hate Applebee's. It's yeah, the no. worst. Like I'm starting to get that, like because like I would always like when my parents were like, "Let's go to Applebee's." I'm like, I don't want to do Applebee's because it sucks. I hate everything on the menu. Is it, yeah, like, I, I've never I've, like I just I hate I'm not into it. No, not thrilled. I'm starting to do that with cheesecake too, with the cheesecake also, factory. I just not thrilled. Yeah. I don't want to go there every every single time I've been there. I've either been sick or the food is just not good. 
or my meal has been comped. My meal has been comped three years in a row. Yeah. Legitimately. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not even exaggerating. It's been comped three years in a row. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, the, uh, I said Angaran and then I see the fucking cat. So I'm like, what? Oh. But fucking, yeah, no, the, the, I don't like the Cheesecake Factory either. And also like anytime around there, it's like packs. And it's a nightmare to get to. Yeah. But every time I've had it, I'm like, I'm not impressed. Right. The cheesecake is, the original cheesecake's all right. But right. that's literally what they do. That's the name of their fucking place. Yeah. So I hope they do that one at least right. right. The, the fact that, and, I mean, this is something that I watched or picked up from um, <laughs> one of <Failed>. those like, <laughs> oh, visit my brother. <laughs> one of those like stupid uh, restaurant oh. episodes. Uh-huh. Um. It's just like if your menu is a big menu and you do a lot of things, it's not a good restaurant. And that, yeah. like, I have taken that and thought about that. So whenever I go to a restaurant that has a big menu, and I get it real has a lot of different, yeah. same. I get very distrustful of it. And that was and, something I learned more from just like existing. That I was yeah. like, and if you do a billion things, and I don't trust, especially like. If you go to a Chinese restaurant and order a hamburger, what that the fuck? Sh- yeah, that shit ain't going to be good. And yeah. also, I don't trust that place now. Uh, right. They should not do I mean, the cuisine that you're advertising. You shouldn't have an out for a different cuisine. I Grilled cheeses are the exception for kids. Right. And that's the only thing that I give some restaurants props to is like, or like points. is like, it could just be for children. Yeah. Which... You're at a ch- Chinese restaurant. Get fucking, like, fried rice. Dude, it's so good. So good. Or, like, even, like, chicken chow mein's really good. Fucking, oh, yeah. Like, uh, sweet and sour. I love sweet and sour oh, pork when I was a kid. sweet and sour pork is amazing. Yeah. And then some bright it colors, so you're just like, mm, okay. Yeah, yeah. And, then, and then you hate yourself afterwards because you're all sticky and your parents send you to the bathroom to wash, <laughs> wash up. I don't think I had that problem, but I also, my parents were very eat with a fork no 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 i eat with a fork too this is the issue if i have anything syrup that's sticky whether it be sweet and sour chicken <laughs> whether it be pancakes or waffles i get sticky it's weird i can eat it's like perfectly my- <laughs> with a fork and a knife and just like not drip over anything and my hands still get sticky, sticky. i don't know what it is my mom that's the same curse my mom has except it's fucking um uh, Whenever she's wearing any sort of white and we're eating something that's red, she Always. gets it on the white. Always. Even if it's like a white and black striped shirt, like yeah. with the tiniest it's white, the white. striped she gets it on the white. I don't know how. <laughs> it's impressive. When uh, when I went to hang out with Emily yesterday, yeah. we both spat something out of our mouths while we were talking. And oh, we were d- both just like, you know what? That's that's me lately. I don't know what's <laughs> happening. I'm like, I gotta knock this shit out because I see it. I know other people say it, see it, and I don't. We both don't acknowledge it. So fucking, yeah. I basically am just like, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I didn't acknowledge mine. She acknowledged hers because hers was actually a good sized chunk of tomato, and mine was like a small like bit of like meat. And I was just like, eh, whatever. That was small enough. And then, like, <laughs> and then, like a cube tomato just comes flying. Mine just like spit. Like, I'm Heck. like, why am I like? My mouth is dry. Why am I fucking expending everything that's like wet in my, my mouth? My mouth has so much saliva in it. I fucking hate it. I, I have it because of braces. I was going to say, I blame mine on braces too. Mine's braces. Yeah. 100% it's braces. Well, so you guys, if you guys get braces, be prepared for that shit. Yeah, be prepared for saliva for or For a not life saliva. of saliva, yeah. Moral story is a good place to stop <laughs> on that note. So we'll catch you guys on the next episode. So until then, bye.